Okay, William Hutchison, Armenia, Columbia Realty for expats and Salento, Columbia Realty. Own them both with my wife. I want to just draw your attention today to EPS uh, contacts. Uh, EPS, as some of you might know, is the government insurance uh, program here. It's really an umbrella group. And um, what happens is people go to the insurer of their choice. Uh, we use Sura, and I suppose Sura bills uh, the government. The government pays Sura. Um, kind of a typical program in many countries. The one thing I want to talk to you about, because I can't talk to you about premiums uh, and those sorts of things. I'll give you a couple of examples, though, that I've heard. The way you get Sura is you have a visa. And the one document here that you'll find if you come to Colombia that's really important is a document called a cedula, C-E-D-U-L-A, which is the National Identity Card. If you don't have that, you can't get EPS, but I'll tell you how you get it. You start by getting a visa. In many cases, it would probably be pension. Some cases, maybe marriage. Others, property owner visa. Maybe digital nomad. Once you have your visa and they're sent, I think for the most part, electronically. I got mine maybe 10 days ago now. Uh, electronically. You just print it off, put it in your passport. But once you have your visa, in order to get your cedula card, you have to go locally to the immigration office and register your visa. You have 15 days to do that. Uh, after that, if you don't register, the fines are a little bit heavy. So make sure you do that within 15 days. The process there is they enter everything into the computer system, uh, fingerprint you, photo you, and send that information off to Bogota. Right now, it's taking eight to 10 days for the cedula to come back to the local office. They'll call you, you go in and pick it up, you're all set to go, and that gives you the, the entry into the EPS system. I'm going to leave the contacts that I'm using uh, in the description below. The EPS rep is daily and that's spelled the same way as daily and uh, I'll give you her uh, phone number and email but I'll also give you her husband's uh, phone number and email. Uh, his name is Rick Jones, he's an American and assists daily in the daily, uh, <laughs> there we go, that's kind of a double-double. He assists daily in the daily um, workload. He can give you uh, premium quotes. Daily is bilingual, so uh, either one, uh, you make the choice. I said I would give you two uh, premiums that I've heard. I've only heard. I haven't confirmed these. Uh, one fella from um, United States, I believe he was 67, and the quote for him was around, at today's rate, exchange rate about $38 a month and uh, another one a gentleman married two children his was about $65 a month to cover everything and believe me you're fully covered it's uh, amazing health insurance here I went through it as some of you know about seven or eight months ago now time flies when you're having fun and the care I got was uh, off the scale Columbia Health rated 22 in the world with uh, Canada, the U.S. and Australia uh, 10, 15, 20 notches behind. So uh, if you're concerned at all about health care coming to Columbia, thinking it's third world, it's top notch, latest techniques. I'll guarantee you, you'll be happy with the health insurance coverage here and the price. So that's it for today. EPS is a big deal. There's some talk about it being discontinued. I doubt that'll ever happen, but who knows with this government. Um, you just have to come, uh, check out the, the uh, premium for you and your spouse. If you're coming single, it's only for you. 
but I'm sure Rick will be uh, happy, and so will Daly, to talk to you. William Hutchison, Armenia, Columbia Realty for Expats, and Salento, Columbia Realty. Have a great day. I live in paradise, and you can too.